NC State women's basketball hosting 10th ranked Florida State at home in Reynolds Coliseum with Ernie Myers. I'm Andrew Sanders. Well, NC State upset Florida State last year down in Tallahassee when they were ranked number six in the country, looking to beat them again when they're in the top 10, and they got it done, a big upset victory for a red-hot NC State team. They had won five in a row. Make it six, Ernie. Yes, they are. They played together. They came out ready to play. They played aggressively. Uh, they just took it to them from start to finish. Both of these teams are top five in the country when it comes to rebounding margin, but a key difference NC State only allows 56 points a game. FSU came in averaging 85 points a game that they score. It was going to be interesting to see what kind of tempo this, this game was going to be at. Well, NC State, they locked down a very elite offensive team. Absolutely. They they basically limited the possessions. You know, they slowed the game down and played great defense, and, and that was the reason they won the game. FSU finished with just 56 points, so NC State had them right where they wanted them. In the second half, Akila Mays went out, looked like she twisted her ankle. Boy, is she tough. She came back, got some big buckets. Yeah, they took her back there and behind the curtain fixed her up. She came back out like Willis Reed and came back and helped them win the game. <laughs> and free throw shooting has been a little troublesome for NC State this year. When it came down to it, crunch time, NC State shot 80% from the stripe in this game. They closed it out. They get the victory, make it six wins in a row for Wes Moore's Wolfpack. Is that it? 